Mother Nature can be quite the artist. It was really unique. I mean, it was horrific and beautiful at the same time. Homes in Hamburg, New York, covered in a thick coat of ice. These were totally covered with eight inches of ice. Hank Kleinfelder says the waves off Lake Erie were up to about six feet several days earlier. The temperatures below freezing and the winds, gale force winds, sustained at around 60 to 80 kilometers per hour. The waves were impacting the, our, our shoreline protection, our break walls, and they were splashing up. And because we had very high winds, it, the winds were blowing it, the splash, a wave splash into the homes. Ongoing for several consecutive hours, the ice continued to build layer upon layer. We got probably five to eight inches of ice on the back of the house. And so we were blind on the back side and on the wind side. Um, and I had to use a sledgehammer to knock the ice away so that we could even see out even a little peephole at the back of the house. And with all that added weight, structural stability became a top concern. But ice blocked vents also posed a risk to residents. That uh, situation presents that carbon monoxide would back up into homes. And it's, as you are well aware, carbon monoxide is a silent, deadly killer. This area along Lake Erie in Hamburg, New York, is no stranger to severe weather events. But residents here in Hoover Beach say the frequency and extremity of these events has grown over the years. With the lake level being four feet higher than what it has been in years past, um, every storm is, seems to be magnified and um, getting hit harder and harder up here. February 24th of 2019, we had you know 30 foot piles of ice that were stacked up right up to the doorsteps of the, some of these homes. On Halloween the previous year. We had a, a seiche which um, raised the lake level at the eastern end of the lake by about seven feet. And on top of that, we had over 16 foot waves. Um, and there was a lot of structural damage. Um, the seawalls, we had at least four of them with, with catastrophic failures. And while the initial site was something to marvel at, now the focus shifted to the melt.